You know, it's interesting because we're all here this evening, and I want to thank everybody for being here this evening and, and listening to the four candidates. But we're all here for a reason, and that's one reason, is to remove John Bocheri. Because John Bocheri went in to Congress with, a, with an idea, and clearly he's, he's voted 94% of the time with Nancy Pelosi. He doesn't represent this district, and clearly we need somebody who can represent this district. So when you consider the choices, who will go up against John Bocheri, you really do need to consider all the experience that that person has. And you know, it, if you ever were going to hire somebody in a job, do you hire somebody without experience or with experience? What I bring to the table, and I've said this all along in all my campaign meetings, I bring to the table 27 years of balancing budgets. I bring to, to the table eight years of some very tough times at the city of Wadsworth, balancing an $80 million budget where you made decisions that weren't didn't make people happy. And you made decisions that in many cases made people mad. I told people when I was mayor, I, got, I ended up with more enemies than friends. But the reason you end up with enemies is because you're willing to stand strong and make strong decisions. Now the other thing when it comes to raising money, it's part of the game and you have to do it. But I always say that if a guy gives me a dollar or two dollars in, in, as part of this, those are people that support you, whether it's a dollar or two dollars. And I, and, and I always said when I was, at, when I was the mayor of Wadsworth, the dollars that came into the city were the most important dollars, and I would stand behind and make sure that those dollars were always spent properly. And I think that's what you need to do. You need to look at the candidates and make a decision, number one, who can, who can beat Mr. Bocheri in November? Because ultimately, that's important. The second thing is, who most represents your values? We all stood up here and talked about very similar values. We're all very conservative, as you can tell. We have a lot of similar values. So then you've got to step back to the second phase, which is, who represents me and can beat Mr. Bocheri, but also, who has the experience to make those tough decisions that can stand up against either side of the aisle in Washington. Look, I've done it in my personal life, I've done it in my business life, and I've done it in eight years in government in Wadsworth. So what you need to do is really look to the experience of, those of all the candidates up here and make the decision, if you agree, that the experience of what you've seen with the candidates, the experience that I have, the 27 years, is what we need to get down there and get America back on track. I'm not running, in many cases, you've heard this, I'm not running because I need this job, I'm running because I want to serve my country and I want to bring America back to what it should be. And I'm going to do whatever I can to represent the 16th district and make sure that all of you are represented and not Nancy Pelosi representing you. And I look forward to having that opportunity. I hope I can gain your support, and I hope I can get a vote from every one of you. Thank you very much for being here.